you're just now noticing that you can't see my face? Come on, dude. And that's the one thing you want to see. Yeah, I know. This is the first time I try using a camera with the PS4 game, though. <laughs> You're always just lurking. Mm, I'll give you the vitamin D on verse. This is the place. <laughs> Sorry, too much? Too much. Oh, he likes it spicy. Okay. It's more than you ever said, Tails. <laughs> Be gentle. No promises. Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. Wait. We really need your help. Come on in. He looks old school wealthy with that house. Like real old school. Come on in. Don't be shy. The house does not match what the guy looks like. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, hello. Oh, don't be afraid of our big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. Please, make yourselves at home. Luther's a big boy. How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he said you could help us. I see. I don't remember that part. Deviant, huh? What about her? Human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. Uh, okay. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Oh, you're right, Lemon. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's... That's exactly what we want. Of course. Well, I can help you. But first, we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. His hands are already stained Come blue. On. Follow me. So we know where this is going. Up. Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Of course. I don't know if I trust this. Right this way? Everything we need is in the basement. I don't trust this at all. I don't like this place. <laughs> same, honey, same. And that man. Let's go, I have a bad feeling. Uh, I know. I don't trust him either. We have to be careful. 
He's gonna sell us on the black market. Please excuse the mess. I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. That's good. Oh, I was supposed to go back to her, wasn't I? Yeah. Come on, Alice. What'd you see? This huh? way, please. I'm getting the creeps from this. What the hell kind of half covered well is this? Yeah, get out of here. If you could just stand over there. I don't want to. Man, my body doesn't fetch anything on the black market. But yeah, we know where this is going. <laughs> hey, Tyler. What's going on, man? Long time no see. How you doing, buddy? I should warn you. This could be quite unpleasant. Oof. Yeah, nothing creepy about this at all. You know what's strange? It is, For Tyler, thank you. Reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviance. That's why it's so hard to find them. <laughs> so, actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said that... Yeah, the people believe what they uh -oh. want. Oh. You Deviants are so naive. Yep. They all come to me expecting well, me to Don't help you touch them. her. And I just reset them. Sell them on. Or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No! I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Uh, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Jesus. Wow. Hit the computer or something. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That's that's so sweet. And so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. No, you bastard. Somebody's messed up in the head. Up the same way. Tears and disillusion. Believe me, you're better off being erased and feeling nothing. No more pain. Somebody needs a psychiatrist. No more hopes dashed. <laughs> Almost down to you. Alice is just like, uh, what? <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks uh -oh. like mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, what <laughs> happened to you? Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. <laughs> you bit me. <laughs> I'm teach you some manners, you little bitch. His psychiatrist robot has more feelings than he does. Hello, Luther. Meet me in the living room. What if I just jump down the uh, big well? What are you going to do then? Oh. Okay. No pre- thanks. No pressure.
That's the only thing I see so far. How do I cause a short circuit, though? Ah. Was that the wrong one? Damn it. I tried. Thanks for the heads up, though. So what did I actually have to do? So I knocked over the water but it didn't go onto the computer. Sad dog. There's something right there that I was could have looked at. Okay, so it didn't completely wipe it. Um, I would assume that their memories would be solid state, so... Help us. Erased her memory. Yeah, but the point I was trying to make is only because rotating discs, like, don't get wiped completely, us. they get overwritten, and so there could be a leak. I believe solid states, when you wipe them, there's nothing left. You must remember who you are. Otherwise the little one will die. Eh, maybe it's not important. Plus, it's been a while since I've studied it. Alright, what's Luther got for me? Ew, that's a gross man in the mirror. I like how they just treat our uh, truster to just walk around after a memory wipe. Like they know she's gonna come. Master's dinner is ready. Take it up to him. Yes, Luther. People still believe in Jesus? Anne, you 
want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. My name's Kara. Just all jumbled. And where is the fat bastard? Upstairs somewhere? Why are all the evil people in this game just fat and gross? Set it down on the table over oh, there. is it? What else do they make? Now get rid of that carcass. Uh, take it next door. Please fuck off. The word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking accountant! <laughs> I mean, there Did are some similarities between the two. Yes, Lockham. Luther! Luther! Wasn't there something to look at right here? Yes, Lockham. Yeah. I should be done here in ten minutes or so. I'll have a look at the little one, see what I can do with it. Huh. Interesting. I'll have to I'll look up what other games they've made because I'm I'll really liking this. In ten minutes. Oop, ten minutes to do what? Holy crap. Wait, next door is in another house? Once again, uh oh, I don't want Alice to be in big trouble. We gotta figure this out. <laughs> hey, cupcake, no problem, door. You get you get that big mohawk taken care of. Look at the polar bear, he's so cute. Can you help me, buddy? Kill Luther and this bad, bad man. Well, that's annoying. An oil can? Oh, cracked pipe. Obviously, I don't know my drug paraphernalia. Yeah, yum. What are you doing here? Very yum. The what the hell? Oh, yep. Yeah, we did see that article about the zoo dis or the bears disappearing, I think. Oh shit. Um I take it we're probably probably missing something. Oh, is that the article right here? I don't have the time to read it. Ships fired on, World War III, 33% approval, Arctic tensions. I, don't, I assume I don't have time to read all this. Isn't the clock still ticking? There we go. Alice. 
Yeah, we got. Ooh, there's just a shotgun lying around. I'll take it. It's not loaded. Oh. Uh, why not take it and find the bullets? But okay. But she put it back. <laughs> okay. Hey, Binksy, how you doing, sweetheart? Thanks for checking in, sweetheart. Love your face and hope you had a great stream. Oh, my day's going just fine. It's lunchtime for me. Morning's been pretty busy and afternoon will be as well. So, try and just check out for an hour or so and and get some spaced out time. Yep, we're we're only on for another half hour or so. This game is hella good though. And thank you for the biddies. I'm I'm gonna be like you and forget to to thank people. Alice. See, I was like, get a however much I want. <laughs> My choice. I forget you. I'm so sorry. You were right. We never should have come. We have to go. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? Luther's gonna get him. Luther! Yes, Zach. I'm finished here. Go fetch the little one. Right away, Zach. Uh, how do we get out of here? Just hide inside the fire. Or can we hit him? Fight back. The little one is gone. Why can't it just disappear? Gotta be here somewhere. Sure, why not? Let's burn this mug down. Some people just want to watch the world burn, you know? Oof. Oh, now it's loaded. Of course it's loaded now. Oh. Damn it. Was there a right choice there or not? I figured the front door would be too easy. Shit. Alice! Go, Alice! No, <laughs> I won't leave! Go! Run as fast as you can! Yeah, Luther's just like strolling. I warned you! Dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. Well, now you have no house, bitch. What are you doing? Get out of my way. No. Not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. 
<laughs> How dare you? That's the uprising. What are you doing? Zombie androids. Who let you out? Brains. Get away. Get away from me. Obey me. I'm your master. I'm your master. Ah! Hell yeah. Good boys. Run. I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. Finally, I could see. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the board. Um, I obviously trust you now. I could take you there. Are they all gonna end up I in Jericho? You. you and the little one. All right. I trust you. We trust you. Polar bear. You're supposed to be better than better than real. Alright guys, I'm gonna take a quick bathroom break and then we'll be back for one more before we call it, so just one second. <laughs> Hi Binks. Cat, it's kitty cat. Meow, 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 and a meow, meow, meow. What do we have in here? Oh, kitty cuddles. You can't deny the kitties are snuggles. Mostly because you want them as well. <laughs> Hello, Amanda. Hello, Amanda. Hi. I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? Yes, now we use umbrella. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. Uh, don't remind me. I agree. I may not be suited for this investigation. Maybe you should consider replacing me. Did you manage to learn anything? I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. What else? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings apparently. of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is yes. your relationship with the Lieutenant developing? It's improving. I've come to understand him better, and he's growing accustomed to my presence.
We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. And then I'll be too we late. To stop this. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Off to the bar. I'm sure. It really didn't take long for Hank to get warm on the android. Like, he hated the shit out of them. What's he doing? Um, what? Oh, I thought that was his lap. I was like, um, that's a little weird. Is there something for me to unlock here? Or just looking? Alright, I guess we'll just knock on the front door instead of spying on the guy. Come on. Although... He's probably not going to answer if we knock on the front door. I can't really tell what I'm looking at in the car. knock on the door. Knock knock. Lieutenant Anderson. Anybody home? Um, I don't I don't know, it's it's a brown dog it looks like on the couch. Okay. So we should have knocked first. Now we have to investigate. Where's Mr. Anderson? In the Matrix, perhaps? Yeah, there's a doggy. There's doggy. Who is Sumo? Am, am I missing something? Is that actually the dog's name? Ah. Uh. He must play a bigger part later on or something, if you guys know him that well. Okay, I've checked everything twice. Where is he? Oh... Uh, See, I, didn't, I don't pick up on small details like that. Hey, Quack. Hey, Araza. Um, uh, I relate to Connor, but I like uh, Marcus. And then Kara's just, just sweet. I empathize with Kara the most. Doggy got off the couch. Oh, hey, Sumo. Weren't you just laying down, buddy? Oh, shit. Lieutenant Anderson! Did he drink himself into stupor? Easy, Sumo. <laughs> oh. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? You your don't name. smell like a human. I'm here to save your owner. Yeah, it looks like he just drank himself to 
to death. Art unconsciousness. Oh shit, with a gun? Somebody... Somebody was having some bad thoughts. There's no blood though, thankfully. Puke. Oh. Alright, he's alive. Thank goodness. Lieutenant. Wake up, Lieutenant. <laughs> I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. I have to warn you. Me this alone, may be a fucking android. Fuck the, the shit out of, out of him. I'm sorry, Lieutenant. <laughs> I need you. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here. <laughs> okay, I relate to Hank now. Shoot him! Attack! <laughs> Attack! <laughs> Attack! Fuck, I think I'm gonna be sick. Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. What the hell are you doing? I'm not grumpy, I just don't like you. Uh, I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. <laughs> <laughs> Turn it off! Turn it off! Ah! <sighs> if only that actually sobered you up. What the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? You seem to have personal issues. Yeah. <laughs> you should consult a professional who can help I'm not you. paying for that. Beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. Talking his language yeah, now. Probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. <laughs> There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. There's plenty of clothes right there, too. Well, this would be a good time to get some more info on Mr. Anderson here. What do you want to wear? Ooh, we have time to be nosy. Let's see what we can find. I don't see anything to investigate, though. At least not here yet. Yeah, about all this glass. Um, oops. He's just like, yeah, I'm used to this. There's nothing to be nosy about. Uh, okay. <laughs> Yeah. 
Wonderful. Just uh, sounds like a smoker minutes, too. Okay? Sure. Oh. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> I wonder if he has some kind of terminal disease or something. Time to pull the plug. Oof, this is going to feel like an attack. Recent study has linked the amount of time we spend in front of screens with the widespread antidepressant epidemic. From the time we wake up to the time we go to bed, we are surrounded by screen-based devices. Of course, too much TV definitely won't make your eyes go square, but it can have other harmful consequences. These include poor sleep, strained eyesight, and lack of face-to-face -face interaction, driving emotional underdevelopment, and depression. The study found that two in three people take antidepressants and lack of social interaction is the leading cause. Meanwhile, the average person spends 82% of their time communicating through a device rather than in personal relationships or suffering for it. In response, CyberLife introduced a home psychologist add-on for your Android and a bid to teach us how to communicate again. The upgrade costs $150, but it can benefit the whole family with group therapy sessions and activities adapted for children and adults. They're skeptical. Our society is hooked on technologies. I don't think more technology is the answer. Just go outside and talk to someone. Oof. Sex androids, la la la, we know about that already. Yes, people are going to have sex with robots. Well, there's a time on this too. Hey Sumo, we get to interact with Sumo. Who's a good boy? Oh, you're a good boy. Oh, yes, you are. Yes, you are a good boy. Jazz, I thought he was all into death metal. This is depressing as hell. Jeez. Depressing Bachelor of Life 101 for a middle aged man. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Oh. Let's see how long I can last. Must be collapsed before I found out. There's nothing you in there. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you. Something on the table? Oh shit, I didn't get to it. Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Well, it's on the table. Ow, oh, son of a bitch. Yep, there's that one little thing I missed. Yeah, I'm, I think this is it for me too. Um, we're an hour and 20 minutes in. I'm going to have to get back to work soon. We'll call it here. Um, thanks everybody for coming by. We'll, if you want to stop, stay by. We'll send you off to somebody else. Um, let's go ahead and...